Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. Um, I wanted to do a video about a supplement that I have been, uh, that I purchased from the internet from iHerb that I've been taking recently. It's the second thing that's made a substantial difference to my life recently. Um, I did a few videos about my new shiny low fat diet. Well, not so shiny because there's, there's not fat in it, but uh, my low fat diet and it's been tremendous. It's the first thing since I had my gallbladder surgery two years ago that's actually made a legitimate substantial difference in my quality of life, in eating. I can eat pretty much normally at the moment if I stick to low fat foods. If I do not stick to low fat foods, I have problems. I went for lunch yesterday, ordered a, um, I'm a rookie at this, so I'm making rookie mistakes. I ordered a uh, white cheese salad and I could just tell it was like fatty cheese and a couple of hours later, boom, problems. Uh, if I prepare my own food, I know it's like 3% cheese, bulgur, I'm good. Anyway, second thing that that's supposed to help for post gallbladder stuff, if you have problems. If you don't, there's no, no need to be taking supplements, but it's this one called bile acid factors, and this uh, particular one is by Jaro Formulas. So what this is, is uh, people who've had their gallbladder, I probably know this but the gallbladder stores and concentrates bile and bile is used when you digest fats to make that digestive process easier hence when you've no gallbladder and you eat fatty foods for a, for a lot of people it's substantially harder and you get this bloating and all this other rubbish um so this uh this supplement is intended to kind of um artificially give you more bile if that makes if that if that makes sense it's literally concentrated bile in a pill format and um, it's derived from bovine so there's this supplement's commonly called ox bile uh, so it's commonly sourced from ox uh, this is sourced from uh, this is sourced from uh, bovine sources clearly these aren't vegetarian or vegan uh, supplements although i think you can, you can find tudka that is but in any event this is what i want to say a couple of things about this um about this supplement because there are a couple of user tips that uh, i think i've learned and that other people using this have learned firstly i find this very effective it actually definitely works um what i do is if i'm eating a fatty meal so let's say i'm eating a steak so my current policy is i'm eating a low-fat diet 80 to 90 percent of the time and if I feel like having a cheat day, I have a cheat day and I eat my steak or my pizza, but I eat, I take one of these supplements, these bile acid factor pills. Now, as I said, use, usage is essential. Um, what I've discovered is that you want to eat these, you want to ingest one of these pills, they're fairly big, um, as soon as you start eating. So you eat and then you want to get the pill in and the pill is going to kind of go in your stomach with the food and then that stuff will go down into your uh, small, I presume these are like enteric coated, that'll go down into your small intestine and you'll have a bit of extra bile to uh, break down the fats. So I found if I have a fatty meal, steak, pizza, burgers, falafel, shawarma, whatever, this actually does reduce my symptoms for sure. It's like not even a, it's not even a query in my mind anymore. This actually works. Uh, not amazingly, but it works quite well. Um, so that's number one, is you want to take it with the food. That's extremely important. If you do not do that, if you take this after you eat, you're gonna get horrible reflux, or that's been my experience, because the food's already gone down, it's down in your stomach, and you've just ingested basically bile, and that's going to come up, give you bile reflux, and that's very unpleasant. So um, I've made that mistake, once or twice when I was new to these, I said, ah, you know, I forgot to take them, but whatever, I'll have it afterwards. And it was not a fun time. Um, so that's number one. Uh, second thing is to be um, conservative about the dosing. So this says four capsules uh, per serving size. And I, if you go on, if you read the reviews on iHerb, you uh, see what people say on YouTube, um, that's crazy in my opinion. I've tried two, I even found two um, too much. Now what happens if you have too much? Well, you're gonna have too much bile, more bile than you actually need and uh, excuse the TMI, you're, you might get a little, you might get the runs, uh, you might get that horrible acid, you'll just know about it. Uh, I, I've never attempted four. Two I could tell was a little bit too much. I find one helpful. Um, another thing you could do 
is if you want to start with 0 0.5 you could buy yourself um, empty capsules or just you know pour half of this out open up the capsule and dispense half of it that would be another option now in terms of how I use these um, because they're supposed to be taken before food and their entire purpose is to assist with digestion I don't want to carry this supplement thing around with me so I bought one of these key um, uh, you know uh, key pill holders from AliExpress and that's what I do so I went for a big one because the pills are or the pills are quite big and if I can get this thing open I'll show you I'll show you what it looks like I can fit approximately six to eight um, of these bile acid pills into the key holder so I just keep them on my keys and if I'm out and I decide you know what I'm gonna have a hamburger uh, I just pop out one of these and eat it with the first bite of the meal and so far so good the only thing is you have to remember to refill your this periodically someone knows a better idea please uh, drop it as a comment this is just the system I figured out so far so yeah uh, this supplement is uh, has worked really really well for me I don't I'm not a supplement person I've taken a multivitamin for about one, one month of my life and that's about it. Um, this is the first thing I've sort of regularly taken and I've read so many good things from uh, people in exactly my situation. They had their gallbladder out, they got all these problems and they said that this bile acid stuff just made a real difference and I found it helpful. So between that and the low fat diet, I think I've made like a ton of progress in the space of one month and I'm doing a lot better than I was a month ago when I just didn't know what to eat what was problematic it was all causing problems so i uh, wanted to put that up there uh, bile acid factors by gyro formulas there's other ones and that's everything i know about it so far